Hi there, good evening and welcome along to Transfer Centre and we start this evening with some huge breaking news and it regards Diego Costa. It is our understanding tonight that Chelsea have dropped him from their match day squad. Why? Let's find out because Carve Solical, as you can see, is with me here in the studio. Wow, Carve, what can you tell us? Well, the background to this uh, story is that we understand that a Chinese club have made an offer to Diego Costa through his agent and they are offering him, wait for this, £30 million a year wages after tax. £30 million a year in wages after tax. Diego Costa, our understanding, is obviously wants to listen to this offer, is tempted to move to China. For the past three days, he has not trained with Chelsea amid reports that he's had a bust-up with one of Chelsea's fitness coaches. And what this all means is that the Premier League's leading scorer, somebody who scored 14 goals for Chelsea, has been dropped from Chelsea's squad, which is making its way to Leicester to play against Leicester City uh, tomorrow. No Diego Costa, £30 million on offer a year in wages. It's a sensational story, sensational developments. The season he's had so far, Carve, the goals he scored for Chelsea, he could become a Premier League title winner potentially in May. So what are Chelsea saying this evening? Have they said anything publicly? Publicly, Chelsea are declining uh, to comment. But what we understand is this is another situation similar to what we're seeing at West Ham. Chelsea's position is that uh, Diego Costa is their player. He will not be sold. And we understand this goes right to the top of Chelsea. The Chelsea owner, Roman Abramovich, is maintaining that he wants Diego Costa to stay at the club and he will not be sold. Now, interestingly, there were a lot of reports over the summer that Diego Costa was close to returning to Atletico Madrid. He gave an interview a couple of uh, weeks ago uh, saying that he changed his mind, that he was happy at Chelsea now. But over a, quite a long period of time, he has been quite unsettled in London. Lots of reports that he wanted to go back uh, to Spain. But now he has this incredible offer on the table from China. Uh, an offer that he wants to listen to, but an offer that Chelsea are saying they will not let him go. And it then puts Chelsea in a position where are we midway through the, this transfer window nearly. Well, they have to decide what to do. As you say, they're saying now that, that he isn't for sale. But if he does go, surely they need to go out and find a, a top draw replacement. I think Chelsea are, are in quite a strong position. He has two years uh, left on his contract. Chelsea happy, obviously, with somebody as rich as Roman Abramovich. They do not need to sell any of their players. The, the steer that we're getting from Chelsea is that he will not be sold. This is not a question of uh, Chelsea being tempted uh, to take the money and reinvest it. There's only about uh, two and a half weeks left of the transfer window. I don't think that is on the cards. And then bear in mind, if a club is willing to pay somebody £30 million a year in wages, that would make him the best paid player in the world. Then you're talking about a transfer fee. A transfer fee that's been mentioned is a fee probably of about £80 million. And the club that has been mentioned, a club who, a Chinese club who are looking for a striker, are Tianjin Quanjian is the club uh, that are reported to be interested in signing him. And they're putting a package together, £80 million transfer fee, uh, £30 million a year in wages. Obviously, this has appealed uh, to Diego Costa. But Chelsea, staying firm, staying very resolute, saying that he's our player, he's 28, he's got another two years left on his contract, he's scored 14 uh, goals uh, for us. He wanted to leave in the summer, we convinced him to stay. He's been working well with Antonio Conte until this week, until this offer uh, arrived. But I think what we're seeing is another situation exactly like the same situation we have with Dimitri Payet. With Dimitri Payet, it seems to be a bit different because he wants to go back to Marseille for family reasons. I think here, reading between the lines, the, the money on offer uh, for Diego Costa is absolutely staggering. It is almost, you're talking, what, three quarters of a million pounds a week. And so is it, is it your understanding, Carve, that as long as this continues, that there's something of an impasse now, that he will not play for Chelsea again? as long as this situation we're at at the moment continues? Well, what we do know is... He's out of contention for selection. 
I think in the short term, absolutely. I think that he hasn't trained for the past uh, three days. He's had a major uh, falling out uh, with the head coach, Antonio Conte. He hasn't travelled to Leicester. He will not be involved in this game against Leicester City tomorrow. The information we have at the moment is that unless this, until this issue is resolved, he will not be playing for Chelsea again.